didn't have a great skate, but still finished in 16th place in the short program. The world junior champion, 10th in four continents. Of course, this is first world championships. How's he going to do here? Nam Nguyen, music from Bach. about that restart for a 15-year-old. Triple axle, triple toe loop. Well, that was clean as a whistle, wasn't it? Here's a second triple axle. Safely landed. So fast in rotation, triple loop there. Let's double toe loop. He's really finding it. A piece of cake here. Triple Lutz. Sixth triple so far. Triple number seven, the Salka. Double toe, double loop. Well, there again, 
A young man comes out and says, uh, I'm the business. First time in a major senior competition. It was a wow factor there. Brian Orsa must love it. And what a responsibility he's got with this young man. 15 years of age. Nam and Guyan. Yeah, that was quite incredible. He didn't put a foot wrong from start to finish. Two cracking triple axles in there. And uh, the confidence of this youngster is something to behold. <laughs> you can't believe it, can you? 15 years of age and to come out and skate like that in your first World Championships. He will suffer with the second mark, obviously because of a lack of maturity. It's not as aesthetically good as others, but hey, what a first world championship he's had yeah you imagine once he gets a bit more strength a bit more speed across the ice it's going to be phenomenal to watch this guy develop there's the triple axel doesn't get a lot of elevation but boy oh boy can this guy spin triple toe and the jumps clean as a whistle as well he gets so quickly into that rotational position and so tight in the air he's a slight figure which does help him with his rotation Spins have got to get a little faster, but that'll all come. There's the Lutz, and uh, a beautiful running edge going out of that. So great double toe on the end, eight, outside edge. Eight triples. Yeah, it's incredible, isn't it? 15 years of age. He didn't break a sweat either. No. <laughs> what an amazing talent, and uh, it's, it's wonderful to see this uh, crowd here in Japan going with this youngster. Amazing maturity. Winning World Juniors is obviously a big help for him. And that was only, what, a couple of weeks ago in Seoul. Sometimes he has been inconsistent. Years before that, he was 12th and 13th in World Juniors. But uh, come the big one. He has produced. Now, where are they going to place him? It's going to be tricky. He's going to be in second place. So he moves uh, above Regini, but uh, just slots in behind Kevin Reynolds. Reynolds leads. It's Canada one and two at the moment. Happy bunnies.